everyone. Okay, Trisha here would taught us some tricks to eat healthier and slim down, but sometimes we need a quicker fix than that. Yes, ladies, I'm talking about shapewear. Whether you're shaped like a pear or an apple, the right undergarments can be a real peach. I think we got carried away with the fruit analogies here. <laughs> so we sent comedian Kim Whitley out to investigate these products that drive us crazy and so many of us can't do without. If we're going to talk about shapewear, we got to be in a place where people come in all shapes and sizes. Grand Central Station. A shapewear is anything that you put on that takes the reality and makes it an illusion. You think I have on shapewear right now? No, I don't think so. That's right. You dang all right. I don't. I wore it for my wedding, which was not the best choice. Where did you, where is your problem area? Where would you wear shapewear? Around here, especially since I've had a baby. People in China, they don't wear stuff to make them look skinny? They do, like granny panties. <laughs> it's not sexy. <laughs> Men should wear uh, shapewear. Why not? If women can. I love the British. They're very free. Have you ever worn a girdle? Yes. It would just really squeeze you on the upper thigh. So your legs were numb? My legs were numb. Okay. <laughs> I really don't like the feel of being like so squeezed in. I feel like I can't breathe. Let me see your butt. So you would just squish this part in right there? I don't like the jiggle. So then you sh do like shapewear. It's a de jiggler. Yes. <laughs> Thanks. Girdle. Where are your problem areas? I don't have any problems. <laughs> you just wear shapewear because you like the way it feels? Yes. When you're on the subway and you're moving, you don't want to jiggle. Point taken. So everyone on the subway, if you're a jiggler, I need you to put on shapewear. And we wanted a real pro to weigh in on this conversation, so we invited style and beauty expert Mary Alice Stevenson as well. So nice to see you. Hi. So, Kim, how, how did people feel? You were asking some pretty personal questions there. How did they feel about that? Well, some people were open. You know, my take, I thought all the women had on shapewear and they were just lying. But, you know, once I started asking, the women really wear it to feel better about themselves. That's what I, I learned. And the men didn't like women to wear shapewear at all because they felt like they were deceiving them. Ah, yeah, I gotcha. That was the deception. But I've been deceiving men, you know, for years. <laughs> and all the hair and the eyelashes. I go to bed looking like Beyonce and I wake up like Al Roker. I mean, it's, it is what it is, Katie. <laughs> It's a relatively new industry, and it seems to me that women universally complain about shapewear because it isn't the most comfortable thing, and nothing it feels better than taking off those darn Spanx or whatever it is you've been wearing all day long. So, but but it's a huge business. We it's spend a, a lot of money on these well, things, women right? Are inundated by images of all these stars on the red carpet looking slimmer and trimmer, and so we know they're wearing shapewear. But, you know, how do we do it ourselves? How do we look our best for special moments, you know, in our own lives? And I think it's also, you know, it's how you wear it. That's the key here. And so today we're going to kind of show you how to go from frumpy to fabulous with shapewear. And wear it the right way and cheat yourself skinny so that you look just as good as any star out there. Okay. So well, you know, Mary Alice made over some of the women Kim met. Let's meet them oh, cool. and see how they look. All right. First, we have Margot. Uh, what was Margot's issue? So Margot's issue was that she's gained 20 pounds and she's been living in sweats. And with the right shapewear, we helped Margot get her sexy back. All right, Margot, come out here, woman. Look, yeah. Woo! Look at that. I love her dress. That is beautiful. All right. So tell us, Margot, you look great. I love that dress, too, Thank by the you. way. And I love your red hair. Thank I basically you. love you. Oh, <laughs> 
<laughs> what did you do for Margo? You know, Margo and I had a moment. We all kind of cried in the dressing room doing this <laughs> show, Katie, and fitting. Margo has really been wearing sweats. She is a fashionista. She is a glamour girl. She wants to wear clothes, but she's gained 20 pounds. And so with the right shape wear, we tone the tire around her tummy, which is what she called it. What is on the mannequin is what we have underneath Margo. And it's Sophia by Sophia Vegara. And this is only $23.99, available at Kmart in stores in June. All right, nice job. Margot, you look beautiful. Thank you. All right, next we have Danielle. Okay, what's going on with Danielle? Okay, she wants to feel feminine and has not worn a dress since her wedding day six years ago. And this is what can happen with the right shapewear. Danielle? Right, Danielle. Come on out. Danielle, how, if she feels as great as she looks, what did you do, Mary Alice, for you know, Danielle? I asked Danielle what she wanted to show off, and guess what she said? The sisters, <laughs> right? And the what girls. She, the girls, and what she wanted to hide, which was, you know, her tummy area. Do you want to say how you feel, honey? Because I know you're emotional <laughs> about this. Um, it's been quite an experience. It really has. I have a three-year-old daughter. It's been three years, and I haven't lost the weight, and I've been feeling just, like, totally in a terrible place and so Mary Alice and the team have really helped me feel a, more, a little more beautiful you know I'm not quite there but I feel I feel kind of sexy a little bit you are sexy, sexy. Girl. you are beautiful are good sexy. for you so let's Quickly. Tell us how you transformed so Danielle. What we did is nowadays you can layer shapewear. And we have a busless slip from Levon, Yummy Tummy. Yummy Tummy is a great shapewear line. And so you can actually wear your favorite bra and you just wear that right over. It's very lightweight and very controlling. Well, you walk over the definition. We have Aisha next. Tell us about Aisha's bigger issues. You know, with Aisha, we need to modernize her shapewear, minimize her thighs, and her derriere. All right, Aisha, come on out. <laughs> wow. Look at you. That's what you call working it. Work it, girl. I love that. Uh, really, so much of it is in the attitude and the self-confidence right. in which you carry yourself. Don't you think, Kim? Absolutely. You look beautiful. That is great. All right, Aisha Mary Alice, that, that was when Aisha secret. came to see me, there wasn't really the attitude, because underneath, she felt very insecure, because Katie, she was wearing these. White jeggings under every single pretty feminine dress she has, right? <laughs> and so she's so feminine and pretty and loves fashion, as you can see. So I wanted to kind of modernize her shapewear, and which tightened her thighs and lifted her bottom and made her feel confident. Let's say, do a circle. Woo! What's on underneath is... What lies beneath. <laughs> what lies beneath is Bob Beyond High-Waisted Brief. It's $64. It's got this extra high-waisted shapewear that there's silicone on the top, which you can't see from this mannequin. But the problem if you've got, um, you know, um, more curvaceous thighs and a booty, a lot of times it droops, shapewear droops. And there's a silicone rib around the top, which really keeps your shapewear in place. Aisha, how do you feel, by the way? Amazing. Fabulous. Oh, mm -hmm. yeah, you look great. Katie, I have a little secret. Yeah. So Katie and I wanted you guys to keep everything head to toe, which is from BCBG. A gift to you from BCBG. We're back with style and beauty expert Mary Alice Stevenson. We know shapewear can help us suck it in and hold everything together, but the clothes we actually want people to see can help us do that as well. So Mary Alice, Absolutely. are there, I mean, I try to practice this every day with my <laughs> clothes, but are there basic things that you can do to wear more slimming outfits? Absolutely. First of all, you always look great. Thank you. Always. I'm trying. I'm and trying to keep it together. You always <laughs> do, right? And Absolutely. I think. Your paw sign must have gone off. <laughs> I think 
people tend to shy away from the hottest trends in fashion. Um, and actually, you can use spring's trends to make you look slimmer and trimmer. So that's what we're going to do today. In fact, you made over some of our viewers yeah. and, and, and really are teaching them some of the tricks of the trade. First is Barbara. Let's take a look at Barbara and tell us Great. what, she, well, Barbara, hello. Well, Barbara, you hello. Need to Barbara, Barbara jeans. lives in <laughs> jeans. And it's Barbara's 60th birthday. And we wanted to give her a new look that was sexy. And she wants to go to work and look beautiful. This ages her, And right? she's a really pretty woman. She's beautiful. You know? So and let's see what, what you look. did. Barbara, come on out here. Great. All right, so tell us what, first so, of all, Barbara looks amazing, and she does look, you You have a beautiful figure. Oh, she? thank you. Because she was top he heavy and more of an inverted triangle, we picked color blocking. Color blocking is a big trend this spring, and you can really make it work for you. See how the black kind of minimizes the shoulders at the top, and it gives her more of a hip, and then I belted the waist to, to give her more of a waist. She looks 60 years young. Yeah, you look amazing. <laughs> Anything else we need to know? Well, obviously, Barbara's got some seriously high heels on, and that Very does high. help. Let's face it, right? Yeah. yeah. We were practicing walking in the heels. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but it does elongate the leg. And the great news is that platforms nowadays, you know, you can get away with wearing high heels at their platforms because they're far more comfortable. That's You've got great. them on. I've got platforms on as well. Well, Barbara, you look great. How do you feel? I feel glamorous. And this whole dre this dress, this entire look, $128 from Ann Taylor. Wow. Nice. My favorite right, store. Let's stand over there. Thank you, Barbara. Okay, now we have Next Ashley. Ashley. So let's look at Ashley before. So Please. she loves fashion and wasn't wearing it. She complains about her belly. She calls it the belly bulge. And she was in tears in the dressing with me because we put her in a trend. She thought she could never wear peplum. So here we go. All let's right, Ashley, Ashley. Let's see Ashley in peplum. Ashley's been doing that for the last 24 hours. She feels literally was in tears, Katie. This, you know, she's young. She loves fashion. We took two big trends, floral and peplum, that are out there. We're hiding her belly bulge. We took a black pencil skirt. I don't think you look like you have. A I know, belly right? Bulge, because, by the way, because she's wearing it the right way. She belted the waist. The peplum is covering up her troubled spot. This is a way you can modernize it and update it for summer by putting it with a colorful print. Plus, she has the statement right. necklace, which statement I think necklace. is great. Brings a lot of light to your face. And good news, skirt $17, top $24 at H&M. Wow, <laughs> nice. All right. Ashley, thank you. And finally, we yeah, have Amy. Amy. All let's right. Look. Let's look at Amy's issues. You know, Amy is newly single um, and she really wanted to look feminine and she's got an awesome body, but we needed to kind of um, create more of a, a silhouette for her that was hourglass shaped. And I did it with a trend, stripes. Stripes is everywhere. Everyone wears it in a casual way. The stripes this summer are feminine, fun, and sexy. And I'll show you why. All right, Amy, come out here with your stripes. ready for date night, right? Tell us about right. this, and, um, Alice. You know, what we did was we kind of um, showed off those shoulders, which she loved. She's got a very small um, lower half. We used the ruffle to kind of balance that off. And stripes, horizontal stripes, people shy away from. They get so intimidated by yeah. them. But this dress works because they're gradiated. They come down. So it actually minimizes the waist. And I say wear all those stripes because we love them, but wear them in a feminine way. Even if you have a striped t-shirt, pull it out, wear it with a pencil skirt, throw on jewelry, and have fun with stripes in a more sophisticated way. And tell us about the price range of, of um, Amy's This is outfit. a little bit more expensive. This is $250 from BCBG. All right. Well, you look great. Thank Money you. Thank you very much. Thank you. And good. not only did you all get a makeover, but guess what? Mary Alice, you get to keep everything head to toe.
do you have some fun tonight? That's right. Mary Alice, thank you so <laughs> thank much. You, this Katie. was so much fun. You can go to katiecouric.com to read Mary Alice's exclusive shapewear tips and also how to find out more about the shapewear and clothes on the show today. And we'll be back right after this. Still to come.